Hey guys and what's up? Welcome to another tutorial on Ultimate Arena. And uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to set up a Hunger Games Arena type. A lot of you guys have been asking me to do a tutorial on this. And uh, to be honest, it's just like free for all. And uh, there's really no difference not until we update or they do update uh, to make the chest refill. Because right now we don't have anything working on the chest, it's just free for all. So right now I'm going to show you how to set up. So first you're going to do UA create and then arena name so you can make up any name. So I'm going to say HG and then the arena type which will be hunger. And then we have to zone out the lobby. So UA SP. So this zone will be right here. And then you have to go to the very opposite corner and go down. So UA SP. UA done. So you zone out the lobby, it's that simple, there's only two commands to this whole entire plugin, so it's really simple to do. So, now we have to zone out the arena, so you have to go up here, UASP, and then we have to do the second one, it's a bit laggy, they're off the fastest computer in the world. Okay, so down here we're going to do UASP, now UA done. So you zoned out the arena accessible. Okay, now we're gonna um, set a lobby spawn for red team. So where the people will be spawned um, when they join the lobby. Make sure you have a lot of room above because sometimes they spawn way up here. So UA SP, then UA done. So this is where everyone will spawn. Okay, so now this is the part that is different compared to all the others other than free for all where you have to set the point for in the arena when they spawn before they're about to kill each other. So, first you're going to say right here, UASP. UASP. At least have two spawns for the players, otherwise you may mess up because you can't kill someone. You just have to do UA leave. UASP. And UASP. Right now they do not have chest refills, like I said. Um, a chest does not refill yet. Don't know if we're going to add that in. So uh, maybe in the future if they do. So after we do that, you're going to say UA done. So it's that simple. So to test it out, I'm going to bring my own guy in. Some of you guys may ask, uh, why is my YouTube account named Carto77 when I have a TAT account? Well, the question is answered because I have two accounts. So I'm going to do on this one. UA join HG have to stay in still for this UA join HG alright so the default class is Archer you can change it in the um, in the configuration or later I'll show you how to put signs right here in a separate tutorial of how to create classes where you click the sign and you turn into that class alright here we go so, like I said, I'm right behind him. You get spawned wherever you set up, and uh, this is the default class, Archer. And you probably are asking, why do I have slime balls? Well, there's a different plugin where the slime balls turn into grenades. So, all right, I'm gonna shoot this guy. Goodbye, mate. Have a nice day. Why don't I just slaughter him to death? One last kill. And there we go. So, now, that's weird. It's not dead. Go back to game fast. Oh, yeah, that's why. Okay. So now I have, um, I get XP. Oh, and I get a reward. <laughs> and I fell off. So I get a reward. I don't know why TNT. I probably set that up in the future. Um, so that you get butter or gold for some of you guys. <laughs> um, so that's pretty much how simple it is to create a Hunger Games. So thanks for watching and I hope you guys really liked it.